Hello and uh, welcome back again to uh, our competition here in Yerevan. This is uh, the second day of finals. And uh, we are going to start with uh, women's division. We have uh, women's sports sambo and men combat sambo tonight. And uh, we are going to witness a lot of interesting fights, taking in consideration uh, the way the, uh, the preliminary fights went. This is going to be pretty interesting. So, in this fight, in red uniform, representing the first team of the International Sambo Federation, Oksana Kobaileva, and her opponent, also representing the same team, Mohametyanova. Mohamed Yavanova had a very, very interesting um, morning event today. She she fought some of the best fighters in uh, in this weight class and she succeeded to win. Kobaleva had uh, a good uh, a good morning event, but uh, with some um, but a little bit less eventful. So this means that Kobaleva is a little bit more, um, a little bit less tired. Let's put it this way. Mohatyanova was looking for an outside sweep that didn't work, and we are back, looking for the big throw. Was uh, was Kobaleva? Well, so far, um, both of them are looking for their favorite techniques for uh, for their favorite grips. Nothing really spectacular happened. Again, looking for a throw was Kobaleva. Mohametyanova is very, very aggressive, though. She tries to stay active. She tries to to stay dangerous. Here we go again. Nice attempt for an inside sweep. Kobaleva is looking now for the arm. She has the arm. She doesn't have the position. Her opponent is able to, to escape very, very, very quickly. Well, another half point deduction. Muhammitanova looks a little bit tired, and it's um, it's quite obvious why, consider considering um, the first part of the competition, she had very very difficult fights. Kobalva is waiting for her technique. She's not in a hurry. She knows she can control the rhythm of the fight. She tries to uh, to get a lapel grip, but her opponent is uh, only looking for the sleeves. So both of them stay really, really defensive. Again, looking for the grips, both of them. Mohamed Yanova trying to stay very low and to control the sleeves.
feel very relaxed, but I, but I think that uh, Kovaleva wants this rhythm of the fight. There is a little bit of pressure and there is a, a constant uh, look for um, for the grips. Kovaleva looking for uh, for an arm lock from her back. It didn't work. Again, looking for um, for an ankle lock is uh, but uh, but still she cannot find her rhythm. She cannot find her position. Kovaleva is very very relaxed, very methodical in her approach. She is not uh, she is not even looking like she's trying, but she controls the position very well and she controls the distance very well. As soon as her opponent wants to, to get a grip, uh, Kobaleva is moving around. And now she tries to, to overpower her. She will look for, uh, for a submission from this position. Trying to, to insert the leg. She almost did it. Now she needs to, now she needs to reverse her opponent. She has, she has the arm. She has one arm, but she, doesn't have the one that she really wants now she has the position now she has the position she will try to uh, to reverse her not bad not bad but uh Mohatyanova is uh, is trying to escape right now still defending 11 seconds left Mohatyanova tries to tries to move and she succeeds to to turn over it his uh, well she had the arm but uh, but she had the arm way way too too late anyway i think it's going to be the victory for kobaleva she dominated the fight so she was looking for a submission and uh, also her opponent got um, the half point deduction victory for uh, aksana kobaleva in women's under 50 kilograms